Today we will be reviewing an integration between ServiceNow and ShareWell, and more specifically creating incidents in ServiceNow and transforming them to incidents in ShareWell. The first thing we see after signing in ZigiOps is the dashboard, which provides information about our licenses and integrations, as well as additional statistics and metrics data. The first step is to visit the Connected Systems section. There, we choose the systems we want to integrate. Then, we need to enter our credentials for each system to connect with ZigiOps. Next, we go to the Configurator section to choose the integration template we need. You would also be able to import and create your own custom integration template. This way, you can define your integration requirements from the ground up. Then we can visit the main configuration page. It includes our systems, the data type we are going to sync, and the correlation logic ZigiOps is going to use. After the data between the two systems is transferred, we will keep both records synchronized with updates in both directions. Next, we can proceed with the action levels. For each integration, we can have as many actions and operations as we need. Finally, we can visit the field map section to define how the data will be collected and how it's going to be delivered to the destination system. Now I would like to show you how the integration works. Here we can see our ServiceNow system on the left side and our ShareWell system on the right. I will proceed with creating a new incident in ServiceNow and see how ZigiOps will transform it to an incident in ShareWell. Afterwards, I will make some bidirectional updates for us to test the synchronization capabilities of ZigiOps. This was the demo that we have prepared for our demo session today. If you are looking to connect ServiceNow and ShareWell, you can book a technical demo with our team. Thank you for watching and until next time!